Hey, Yolanda, how you doing? I hope everything is going well with you. Um, I did do your protection candle, your hex removal, your curse removal. I also put in other extra stuff in there since we already discussed what's going on with a lot. Uh, definitely a lot. Um, you is January the 27th, 78, a sign of Aquarius. This is a spell in there to remove all the evil. I ask the divine to protect you in every way that he can. I ask the divine to remove all blockages, all hate, all hexes that's on you, all type of spells people doing, all types of negative shit. Reverse that shit a hundredfold back to the rightful owner. I also ask the divine to open your doors for all types of money blessings and anything that's positive in your life. Let it come to fruitation in the divine I trust. Amen. So this is your candle. It will go over there with all my other ones, but I always let it go down first. I also went on ahead and did bitch shut up spell. I'm not going to say the name that you gave me, but the person is already in a bitch shut up spell. This is the shut up spell where though people just got so much negative to say or always got your name in their mouth or you just know they on some bullshit. These names is really three, four hundred, but I, you know, what I mean, I put this person in here because they need to be in here. This never opens. This is shut up spell. I had to do a spell before I put their name in here. This is also the candle. I did not light it yet because I have some more to do, but this is the bitch shut up spell. So that person name is definitely in here and it's, it goes in the way is however divine feels fit that they need to shut up. It could be whatever. It could be they having a mouth problem. It could be death. It could be whatever. I can't control how divine want to shut them up, but that's the shut up spell. I'm also going to do you a full reading. This is what you really been needing and you've been wanting. Um, always take what resonates. Don't make something on you when it's not. This is for entertainment purposes only, but I've been doing this since 12. You already know that. Um. So, yeah. We're going to ask the divine to open all doors so we can see and not be able to read your reading accurately, officially, and quickly. I do not sugarcoat anything. Whatever I see, it is what it is. Um, I can't really pinpoint if it's love or whatever the case may be. Whatever comes out is what's come out. I'm speaking to you through divine eyes only. He may have something to tell you in different areas of your life and may not focus on another part of your life. Or he may be talking to you in other aspects. You know who's around you. I'm going to let you know what energies is around you as far as the signs. You know who is around you. You know what's going on in your life. Whatever you didn't tell me or whatever you did tell me. Whatever you didn't tell me may come up in this reading. Um, some things that you may tell me may come up in this reading. I'm not sure. I will be able to let you know. I will be doing a full reading. This is not time-based, Yolanda, so I don't know how long this would be. This could be quick. This could be long. Um, I also do all types of love spells. I do protection candles. I do uh, voodoo spells. I do heal me spells. Um, whatever type of spells, I do it all. I do heal me candle spells for people that's sick. Like, I always keep my mind well lit. So, yeah. So, we're going to go ahead and we're going to see what's going on here. You know, Spirit God, Holy Angels, please let me read these readings accurately, efficiently, and quickly. And the divine I always trust. Amen. Okay, that's how I come out. Not yet. Okay, we're going to go ahead and see what's the overall energy of your reading, Yolanda, and see what's going on with you here. You got somebody in your energy that's not to be trusted here. You could be dealing with a cancer that came straight out that was like, damn. You could be dealing with a cancer. So you're dealing with somebody in your energy that's a cancer that's not to be trusted. Could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. I don't know why I said that. It could be, but no, it's Scorpio Pisces a cancer, but that's literally a crab energy, a cancer. So you may be dealing with somebody that's in your energy. They're coming to offer you something, but they're not to be trusted here. So you know, so you already got some shicey shit around you. What is the energy? Yeah, this could be somebody coming back from your past here that want to offer you some type of emotion here. Scorpio Pisces cancer. This could be somebody you knew since childhood here. You got to watch out people that come back from your past in your past here. That's the energy bottom of the deck. You got a lot of people gossiping about you and hating on you here, telling lies on you. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. That's your present energy here. If that's the haterade card, let's see what else is going on here universe yeah you're coming up out of having strength for a lot of situations in your life you could be dealing with a leo it don't have to be you're overthinking situations in your life you feeling like that you trapped in situations gemini libra aquarius for your future energy
see how your candle light is so bright like this like setting up like that that's a that's not that's a lot of crazy energy around you yo i'm gonna blow you out so i can fix that y'all see what's coming up for your future here yeah seven of pentacles here this could be somebody focusing on how to get more money here capricorn taurus virgo energy or this could be you thinking about something or somebody in your energy thinking about how they gonna get money from you uh future energy you got somebody that's a liar in your past here um somebody gemini libra aquarius in your energy that's coming back from your past is lying to you about something or they was a liar in their past here you could be coming up out of a lot of anxiety here or somebody could literally be coming up out of jail and coming up out of lies here take what resonates gemini libra, libra aquarius with the um Eight of Wands here, well, not eight, I mean seven. Seven of Wands here, reverse. You're coming up out of taking taking up for yourself, standing up for yourself in some type of way. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy, or there could be somebody else here. What is the energy surrounding Yolanda at this time? Yeah, you could be dealing with three people here. Um, It could be a third-party situation. Somebody may have you in in the future. Always take what resonate, leave the rest. You could be dealing with Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. You can't make something happen or somebody else couldn't in the past. Um, You could be dealing with Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy here. Yeah, somebody's unhappy having a lot of family difficulties here, past energy. You may be coming up out of a lot of um, jealousy that's surrounding you or coming up out of fake competition around you, present energy here. Somebody is arrogant and rude, very, very demanding or somebody don't have money like that. You could be dealing with an Aries here. Um, it could be a Taurus. It could be a Capricorn. It could be even a Virgo in your future here. Everything you wish or hope for is coming towards you here. It's like you got one foot in, one foot out. Aquarius energy with the star here. What is the energy? Yeah, you could be coming up out of a third-party situation is your overall energy here. Coming up out of lies, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Somebody is bad news, or you could be getting bad news that's coming towards you. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy here. Yeah, somebody's under devilish energy around you. You could be dealing with a Capricorn, or this is somebody that's just in devilish energy, period, here. Overall energy. What is the energy? Yeah. Um, if you're waiting for some type of money coming toward you that's supposed to be divinely guided over our energy, it's not coming at this time. I see that you're closing off cycles or closing out cycles in the past energy. You're literally telling people, fuck out of here is the energy, your present energy here. With the Ace of Swords here, you cutting people off. you getting truth and clarity, clarity about them, and you cutting them off in the near future. The Death card is here. Something is permanently ending. This could be a person, place, or thing. Take what resonate and always eat the rest. Scorpionic energy. You turning your back on something that no longer serves you here in the past. Eight of Cups, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Somebody had the whole world in their hands, or somebody thought they had the whole, whole world in their hands with you. Or it could be you with somebody else. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, present energy. Again, the devil energy is here in your future car you could be dealing with a capricorn or this is somebody you cut off they in under devilish energy it's a lot of devilish energy around you you're like blindsided you don't know which way to go um you're not sure what road to take gemini libra aquarius energy you coming up out of letting people get away with shit getting away with snaking you and getting away with lies past energy here what is the energy surrounding this reading yeah you're coming up out of making any foolish decisions as your present energy and it's like you want to offer somebody some type of emotion or a cup of love or that could be somebody offering you something scorpio pisces cancer they're trying to offer you a cup in your near future yeah with the queen of swords you definitely cutting people off then don't lock or serve you it's like you sitting you the queen you don't got time for it this is literally like verbally telling people that i'm not fucking with you no more you focusing on your money at this time you could be working on saving your money everything you wish for is coming true here aquarius energy for the past energy with the hangman reverse, you're coming up out of being stuck in anything is what I'm seeing past energy. It's a lot of confusion around you, a lot of choices, a lot of mass. You're not sure which one to take. You're not really sure what's at the bottom of these cups here. This is um, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer energy for your present energy here. With the four of wands, you're coming up out of rest retreat and praying about some situations with and lies which you need to pray more. Yeah, there's a lot of confusion around you, especially in the future here. What is the energy? Yeah. 
somebody is coming towards you offering you some cups somebody is fake as fuck this is like a fake ass friend or something scorpio pisces cancer this is your over energy somebody fake somebody backstabbed you you had a painful end a backstab a betrayal in your past here you're coming up out of leaving stuff in the past you want to live in lies here um yolanda this is saying that you need to leave the past alone and move forward but you're not here your present energy you have a failed victory in your future here as well sagittarius aries leo you coming up out of letting people snake you though your overall energy being grimy towards you and lying to you that's my snake card here the will of fortune is on your side or it was in the past for good luck here yeah, you're just comfortable in your finances. You just live in life, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy. You just building up your money, building your name, your fame. You working towards something here. With the King of Cups, this could be somebody coming and offering you some bullshit ass love that's not even going to work here. Scorpionic um, Pisces energy. Scorpionic, yeah. It could be somebody that you was a, with a lover with. Somebody you was in love with or this is a lover or this is a decision you got to make about a lover in the past. You're coming up out of overthinking situations now or coming up out of feeling trapped. There's a lot of secrets that came out. Scorpio Pisces energy for the future will be coming out. You could be dealing with an Aries, an ignorant, arrogant person here. Somebody that's just nasty as fuck here. Um, yeah, with the Virgo energy reverse, you're not going within, you're not meditating and praying like you should. In the past, she was happy here. I'm seeing that could have been even with somebody. You're coming up out of um thinking about something you lost here, Scorpio Pisces Cancer. You're not making no movement toward or away from a situation, present energy. You're not loving yourself or loving the divine when this ace of cups is reversed here in the future. It's a partnership or friendship that's coming towards you, but it's gonna bring a tower moment in your life, Sagittarius. Aries, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Um, this could be somebody that do want to offer you a new partnership, relationship, friendship, even a marriage here. But with the time and moment, it could be good or bad. With this reading, it's going to bring up a, a negative energy into your space here. And that is definitely in your future here. You're not going to be able to have a new beginning with this situation here. Overall energy. Yeah. With the magician, you got everything you need to make something happen the way you want it to happen. Overall energy. You got to have a lot of patience here is what it's saying. You want to get everything you wish for and hoped for. Aquarius energy. Yeah. You waiting for your ships to come in. They're coming. You're coming up out of or somebody coming up out of plotting and trying to defeat you and be shisty here. That is the future card. The overall energy is you making something happen. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy here is the overall card. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, is the overall card. Um, yeah, you could be dealing with an Aries, somebody that's arrogant as fuck here, past energy here. Somebody always got their hand out. They're not giving and taking equally here in your present energy. Some secrets is coming out about a Capricorn, Taurus, a Virgo for the future here. Somebody is watching you. This indicate trouble with the police or authority figure. I don't like this card. It's your overall energy here. Yeah, somebody's not to be trusted in your energy. You could be dealing with a Scorpio, Pisces, a Cancer. Yeah, some secrets is coming out. A whole lot of shit could be dealing with a Leo. You may be dealing with legal situations or a Libra, or you may end up having legal situations in your present energy here. You just want to be happy here. It's your future card. You got to positive judgment on you from the divine here for the overall energy with the king of swords you definitely been watching somebody and cutting people off here in the past somebody may want to offer you something but it's like young money no money it could be somebody younger than you capricorn taurus virgo with the knight of rods you making something happen here is what i'm seeing in the future card with the star here like i said this is your energy occurs energy you is wishing for something that's going to come true here that's the overall energy in the past she was unhappy about a situation it could have been a Leo here. Yeah, it came out again. You was unhappy maybe with a Leo. And somebody is not to be trusted, trusted in your present energy. You could be dealing with a cancer here. What is the energy here? Yeah. You're coming up out of overthinking situations here. And you the ten of pentacles, pot out, bitch, is the energy, your money right, your family life right. But it's like something else is going on, and that is in the future energy. Yeah, the Ten of Pentacles. This is having your money and finances right in the future. You're coming up out of just having one wand and make something happen. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy. 
Yeah, you could be celebrating with somebody here. Overall energy, somebody could be juggling you with somebody else, or you could just be in bit, or you could just been being balanced in the past. But I feel like your past had a lot of shit going on. You're coming up out of having a lot of shit on your plate and shit here. Ten of Wands, Sagittarius, Aries, Leo energy here. Yeah, your money could be coming in fast. Present energy here. You coming up out of making something happen. You could be dealing with a Sagittarius here. Yeah, somebody can't make something happen with you. That could be you or them. You're coming up out of having a lot of bullshit on your plate for the overall energy. With the Queen of Pentacles, somebody money couldn't have been right in the past. Or somebody was spending money needlessly. You could be dealing with a Capricorn in the past. Yeah, it came out again. Yeah. You could be upset or a Capricorn could be upset in the past. You could be dealing with a Taurus here. Somebody bullheaded. Don't listen here. Present energy. You using your intuition now. This is a Capricorn Taurus energy here for the future here. Yeah, it's a lot of confusion around you. A lot of choices here. I'm seeing you're coming up out of just having one wand to make something happen. Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, you coming up out of a sickness, being left out on a cold or poverty in the past here. Yeah, you're coming up out of using your intuition in the past here. The divine is handing you that wand so you could have a new beginning in a creative project or something in your life is your present energy here. Somebody definitely ain't to be trusted. This came out like five times. You got a cancer in your energy or is somebody that's shysty as fuck. They are crap in your energy. Good luck is on your on your side no matter what's going on here is your overall energy. And you're coming up out of poverty, sickness, or being left out in the cold in the past. It seemed like somebody left you out in the cold you was in a relationship with. You're about to get some confirmation a text message somebody may pop up at your house um somebody may be sending you an email about something is the energy i have for you yolanda it look like it's a lot of shit in your past was a whole lot and but right now you got like somebody shysty here you about to get some bad news and i see you could be that you could be dealing with the police or something um and you got somebody that be watching you they shysty as fuck so like what you told me that shit came out i'm gonna see what oracles come out for you Universe, fairy guides, holy angels. Yeah, something saying pray. You need to pray more. And I see that in your reading. I don't know what's going on, but whatever's going on, you need some type of prayer here. Is one of your energies. Let's see what else come out for you, Yolanda. It's 17 minutes. Your reading was long as hell. Universe, spirit, God, holy angels. What is the energy? I have followed the light. It was reversed. You're not following the divine light. She a bum or he a bum. You're coming up out of dealing with a bum. They a bum came out twice. You got the seven of swords. This is somebody snake and you got away with some shit without you even knowing right now. Take off the rose colored glasses fashion Londa, so you can see what the fuck's going on. Never settle for less. You're coming up out of settling for less here. Gossip is for bitches with no life. You may be coming up out of gossip or somebody else is. He or she is fucking your mate. Somebody could be messing with somebody you messing with. And you got a window watcher bitch around you, which we discussed that. That is so deep. Let's see what else come out for you. Okay, beauty is pain, which you stay keeping yourself together and fire. Somebody may be fired around you. You may be firing somebody. You may hear about somebody being fired. Always take what resonate and leave the rest. Let's see what else is going on here. Let's see what the divine want to say to you. Universe. Spirit God, holy angels, what is the energy surrounding Yolanda? 
you have success. You want to have success in everything that you want to do. Don't worry about it here. You got trust. Trust in the divine. And he will make everything right. You got to pray more here. And then you have, it's up to you. Whatever decision you make is up to you here. Let's see what else coming out. One thing I didn't see coming out of your reading is love. So I feel though the divine don't want you to focus on your love life right now. You got to focus on everything else that you got going on in your life. You don't have room too much for love right now because it didn't come out in your card. And it did, but it came out like a third party situation. So maybe you know you in a third party or whoever you dealing with by somebody else. And that's what you need to know. What is the energy here? You have forgiven and healing. You got to forgive some people. Even the people that talk too much, you have separation. You may be coming up out of a heartbreak or a separation here. And we got divine feminine. You could be dealing with a, another female. Um, I'm not saying that you are, but you could be dealing with another female sexually. If not, this is a divine feminine. It may have a lot to do with a separation um, with you and maybe somebody else. Uh, let's see what else is going to come out. I got two more oracles and I'll be closing out for you. Well, three more oracles. I'm trying to get them close. My butt hurt. Wow. We have put on higher boots. The bullshit is getting deeper. There's a lot of bullshit around you. I definitely see that here. You also have you will earn more fucking money. Your money look great, though. I ain't even gonna lie about that. Your money is excellent. You got my energy around your money. Capricorn energy with them ten of pentacles. That's the highest you could get from the ace of pentacles. So your money is good. Oh, look, the trash just took itself out here. So yeah, you dealing with people that's trashy around you. You want to get more money and it's a lot of bullshit around you and it's just getting deeper. What is, okay. This came out and these came out. So the first one came out is inner peace, intuition and strength. Leo, energy, you got to open your eyes more here. You're coming up out of adaptability and overcoming your obstacles, is saying here. And you're coming up out of crisis and drama here. And you're coming up out of achievement and completion and travel here. But your prosperity and money is pot out. Wonderful. That's what I'm saying. Like, your money is on deck. Whatever's going on, your money is great. You have no financial issues. Your issues is drama that's around you. Haters, people watching you, people lying on you people gossiping trouble with the police or authority figures and motherfuckers is trying to play you like a sucker if you dealing with somebody they in a third party so they not real i'm telling you now if it's just something for sex then cool but if it's something you trying to build don't fuck with them because they 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 lying whoa you got all these that came out i'm gonna take them too oh, i'm just trying to see why it was daydreaming of you somebody could be daydreaming of you or you could be daydreaming of them take what resonate you have also long distance you may be coming up out of a long distance relationship you also have groupie you coming up out of groupie energy or somebody around you is a groupie truth revealed you may find out some truth about somebody here you have for the clout somebody may just be a clout rider here irresponsible somebody is irresponsible around you here you have moocher you may be coming up out of letting people mooch off of you here you also have copying your style somebody you're coming up out of copying somebody's style somebody coming up out of copying you here witchcraft somebody is doing witchcraft on you coming up out of doing witchcraft on you which that's why i did what i needed to do poker face um, this is not showing emotion. This is somebody high in their emotions. This is like a Scorpio Pisces cancer. Somebody could be in a mental prison here. This could be you or somebody else. Somebody could be sabotaging you here, crying over someone. Somebody could be crying over you or you crying over someone. Divorce. Somebody may be getting a divorce here. Low vibes. You're coming up out of dealing with low vibes people here. You also have always partying, playing games. Somebody is coming up out of playing games and partying. More than friends. You may have somebody that's a little more than a friend. Having receipts. Something that's telling you to keep all your receipts. So, yeah, Yolanda, that reading was deep. I mean, what I mean deep, that shit was serious. Yeah, that reading was so, yeah, you got a lot going on. Um, You said your mom in a hospital, so... Let me know if you need a prayer candle for her. I'll do you half price. It's called a healing candle, not a prayer candle. They heal her and get her home like I have to do my mom or whatever. But other than that, your reading is like basically what we talked about. It's all in there. So 
you already know. Whatever you don't know, then now you know. Peace, light, and blessings. I'm going to call you and let you know, and I'm going to send this link. Peace.